Monstera leaves drooping is most commonly due to lack of water. The trouble with droopiness is that it can have many different causes. Some of these causes may require your attention and some won't. They like their soil to always be slightly damp. Other causes include overwatering, low light, fertilizer problems, pests, or transplant stress. Identifying the problem is the most important step to nursing your plant back to health. Underwatering or overwatering. If the soil feels wet a week or more after you last watered, your plant may be overwatered. Underwatering can also cause droopiness. Luckily, this is easier to diagnose and fix than overwatering. If you're watering more than once a week, you are probably watering too much. The more likely issue is that the pot and soil are not draining well enough. If your soil isn't draining for whatever reason, you will want to repot your plant into a pot with drainage and a light potting mix that drains well but holds a little moisture. If your monster is underwatered, the solution is easy. Give it a drink. Too much light, too much sunlight causes more water loss through transpiration. As the plant tries to cool, leaves will have a burnt look, crispy brown edges, dry tips, discolored patches, leaves curling on their edge, turning up. If this goes on for long, leaves will start falling off prematurely. If you see the above signs on leaves closer to the source of light or receiving direct light, move the plant to a shade. Low humidity. Monstera plants prefer moderate to high humidity or between 40 to 80 percent. If your home is dry, your plants may become unhappy. One of the most significant signs of low humidity is drooping leaves. Cold temperatures. If temperatures dip below 65 degrees Fahrenheit, Monstera plants may begin to pout. Therefore, aim to keep the air temperature between 65 to 85. Even if your house is warm, your plant may still suffer due to cold drafts. Ensure your Monstera is located away from exterior doors, poorly insulated windows, air conditioning vents, and any other source of cold drafts. Hope you like the information. For more such videos, subscribe to this channel.